Today is Wednesday, October 9th, 2024. Welcome to the Survivor Fans Podcast. I'm Joanne. And I'm Stacy. And this is a status update. This is not a recap. And we want to say that we're sorry we couldn't do the recap a week ago. And super sorry we couldn't get to the listener feedback show. And... We're not Sorry, gonna... <laughs> we can't do one this week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Either. So we're, we're in the process of moving across the country. This time last week, we were starting our all-nighter, trying to get ready mm-hmm. before the loaders arrived on Thursday morning. And then when they got there at 7 o'clock, we went for seven hours with three loaders. And then we moved on to the next Never test. sitting down. Yeah. So we're in the middle of a whirlwind right now, and I naively thought (laughs) that we'd be able to take a break and do our podcast. And who said that uh, that's not very realistic? You did. Okay. But I agreed that if we could do it, we would do it. Yeah. It's just not. And you agreed if we couldn't, we wouldn't. We wouldn't, yeah. (laughs) We've, uh, I don't think we've ever missed before in the 19 years yeah. That we, whenever we've traveled before, no matter what was going on, even we when actually, I was in the hospital almost dying. And, yes. And you continued. Covered. It's like, no, go home and do the podcast. Yeah. <laughs> if I could do it here, I would. But Yeah. So um, Stacy's been very feeling very guilty and disappointed <clears throat> and feels like he's letting everybody down and... And so we we don't want to do that, but we can, just can't help it right now. We're we're not doing that well. Actually, we're doing great, but we're not. Um, our bodies aren't used to all of this, and we've been going actually for a year. We've been preparing. Yeah, a year September last. You wouldn't September. have thought we would be that <laughs> that unprepared. <laughs> When loading the truck day came. Uh-huh. But someone but thought they really didn't need to, you know, oh, it's not going to take long to sort through 30 years of of uh, living in this house. Mm-hmm. And we're both pack rats. So yeah, we are. I started months and months and months ago, and I packed the entire garage and I all of the kitchen lifted space hun- and, hundreds of boxes. And then I packed everything <laughs> in the living room, and then I packed everything in the family yeah. room, <laughs> And Stacy's like, oh, I should probably go through, start through my room. And I kept looking at it, and he was hauling carloads of things out of there. And I just, I was like, you're, constantly you're never goodwill. getting everything out of this room. <laughs> he said, hmm? no, no, I will, I will. And guess what? He didn't. <laughs> well, I did, eventually. <laughs> well, you did about four days after the truck left yeah. with what they were taking, <laughs> so. And then tried to put it in the car, and of course we had that didn't work either. Well, and we're traveling with Zed, who's the most time he's ever spent in a car was the two and a half miles from our house to the vet. So yes, this has been an adventure too. Uh huh. <clears throat> anyway, all that to say that we've got to put things on hold until we get there. We just we've got over two thousand miles to go to get. To the well, new house. <laughs> it, I, I'm not sure if it was not a mistake to um, uh, talk to the realtor ahead of time because once we did, and um, boy, she went. It accelerated on it us again. It accelerated way too fast. And oh, can I bring someone by? Just no, no, just to look at that. Mm. And I'm bringing cleaners in here. And I'm bit, literally, the cleaners were running us out of our own home yeah i finally stopped and said look you can't mop here right now (laughs) (laughs) i'm loading this out to the garage loaded the the last of our stuff into the car monday at At, six (laughs) o'clock and 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 headed out and went as far as we could the six cleaners and the realtor's daughter helped us haul our staging area in the living room out to the garage and then they all said yeah they, there's no way you're getting this stuff in that car because and they were right yeah, so we just kept there was a things. lot more <laughs> donation that we left in the garage yeah. than we had intended and we ended up mailing um several hundred dollars worth of things that didn't make it on the truck so yeah, we eh. had we had not previously considered the 
post office. With a trailer. It, a, a moving service, yeah. but yeah, we utilized it well, that way. Well, I realized um, it was it was even hard. I knew what to expect. I've moved. I've moved across the country, but Stacy's never moved across the country. Well, yes, you did, but you only had enough belongings to fit in your little Ford Escort when you did it, mm-hmm. and you had no animals or and wife then, or anything like that right <laughs> so it was a little this was a the, little different as you've noted several times <laughs> the company moved me that yes the time. company moved you and brought your car sent your car on the truck and you flew here yeah so yeah not quite the same not equivalent no, no. no. so no. we did 350 plus miles today which isn't a lot, considering things that we used to do. Right. And, uh, but as fatigued as we are and as much stuff as we have that to haul. That was the most we could manage. What, what was the first night? We didn't get to organize anything because, like I said, we were like, nope, can't take this, can't take this here, throw this in a bag, throw the, leave it here, here. The, just told the realtor, here, take my walker. I, I can't get it in the car. <laughs> Donate it. Yeah. <laughs> So, again, uh, we apologize for not being able to cover season 47 better. And especially apologize to the folks who put all the extra effort in the listener feedback show. And, of course, Amazing Pete's already got his feedback in from tonight's episode, which we didn't get to see, but just part of. But we are still going to be on the road, and we're going to cancel. Take a little while the listener feedback show for this coming saturday because we're not yeah we don't want you to put that work in and and us be on the road and then roll into a hotel at night and be too exhausted Mm -hmm. to do anything again well and truthfully our brains aren't working so good it's (laughs) taking both of us and we've actually not even seen last week's episode yeah we tried our best to get into in time but we didn't know it came on at seven here and we we thought we just got here quarter to eight we brushed up and then we we didn't bother to eat we just you know got got settled in turned the tv on and it was 45 minutes in so yeah. we did watch the rest of it though so cool mm-hmm. and uh we, and we we do know know who got voted off last week and uh i i, I even got my picks in someone else didn't but this is true i would have been okay. better off so not this is us, to because this is us rambling. i had, I had the person that went home. Mm-hmm. Yes, we are rambling, and we're sorry, but we did want to say we're sorry, and that yeah. this is what's going on. Everything is really fine. It's just that we have another 2,400 miles or so to go. At least 2,000, yeah. <clears throat> I think we might be 700 or so in at this point. Are we? Somewhere around okay. there. Yeah. Thank you, Paul. Uh, thanks, Jeremiah. Thanks, Steve, for keeping everything working. We will be back. We're not we're not running off. Yeah. We will be back uh, hopefully uh, next week, but we'll just have to see. We we might not even be there next week because we have only we just barely got out of California after right. uh, le- leaving Monday night. But but anyway, hopefully we'll um, we're just gonna try to take it easy and not push too hard because. Uh, uh, because of the fatigue so right anyway sorry that's will. a long status update i was shooting for a quick status. but we will be back so sorry this yep. took so long apologies thanks everybody have a good one